All right, so to jailbreak your iPad on OS X Yosemite, we need to download the files on the description and then uh, click on the big blue button. Click on open. Now that we see the screen, we need to head to our iPad before doing anything else. Click on settings and then enable airplay mode. Go to passcode and make sure it's disabled so it doesn't prevent the jailbreak. All right, uh, follow along and then click on jailbreak. This uh, jailbreak process uh, works on all kinds of iOS devices and works from iOS 8 or below. If you're a Windows user, you can go to their website and download the Windows version. All the link will be in the description. If you see this message, it's normal. It's part of the process. Just click on done. I have a 16 gig iPad and Pango is sending a lot of files behind the scene to make this uh, jailbreak possible. The iPad think that it's full, but if you have a 32 gigs, you will be fine on above. Okay, so look like the iPad is restarting and that's normal. Please don't disconnect your iPad yet. I would like to thank Pangu's team for their efforts and making the jailbreak possible on Mac and Windows. By the way, if your jailbreak didn't work at the first time, please retry it one more time and that should fix the problem. Alright, it's look like we're jailbroken. You will see a lot of windows pop in. Just minimize them and wait for the process to finish. Alright, so it's look like the jailbreak is done and the iPad is rebooting. Okay, once you see the screen, just unlock. And on the second page, you will be seeing Cydia and Pango, and that means you're jailbroken and ready for a world of tweaks and hacks. Uh, if you want, you can click on Cydia and it will set up the file systems that uh, you need. Anyway, I uh, hope you guys liked this uh, video and found it uh, helpful. Uh, please subscribe, that's helped me a lot doing more of these videos. See you later.